if you're going to challenge you're going to see that you're going to encounter big 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 enemies the focus would be definitely to kill them in a specific time frame if you're not going to be able to do that you're just going to need to wait until you're going to have enough resources to do more and more upgrades towards your heroes okay the battles in the arena are going to be quite quite short because as you notice everybody has tons and tons of heroes and here it is the statue will help you over here okay so don't forget to upgrade the statue that i previously mentioned because it will help you also in the arena Welcome to Alliance TV and we are going to check out Hero Assemble. This is going to be an idle RPG and you're going to have quite quite a lot of heroes that you are able to collect. Now your offline income is going to be over here, you can watch ads in order for you to collect more more things from Midas, okay? Watch the ad because definitely it's going to be really important. So you're going to have the possibility to throw into this fight quite quite a lot of heroes you're going to be able to have up to eight fights and you're going to have some sidekicks along the way okay so treat them with respect because you're going to need to collect quite quite a lot of heroes with different kind of rarities and they're going to be really important now besides the fact that you're going to upgrade the heroes you're going to be able to upgrade a trait over here basically a skill tree in a way you're also going to be able to upgrade some statues over here that are going to offer you more and more additional things more attack more hp a different kind of other cooldowns and you're going to have medals over here you can summon the medals also okay so if you're going to go into the summoning part you can summon some heroes you can summon some medals and you can summon some equipment don't forget about the equipment because the equipment you're going to be able to place them on your heroes okay really important the equipment will also add different kind of extra benefits okay towards your hero which definitely is going to be an improvement now eventually you're going to be able to have this rate up you're, if you're going to summon some of the heroes over here you're going to have a higher chance of getting a better and a better rarity let's say hopefully you are going to be able to get better and better heroes now if you're going to challenge you're going to see that you're going to encounter big 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 enemies the focus would be definitely to kill them in a specific time frame if you're not going to be able to do that you're just going to need to wait until you're going to have enough resources to do more and more upgrades towards your heroes okay that's going to be it it's not going to be that hard for sure you have played similar games and for sure you need to subscribe for this channel because daily you're going to find a new ad game and at least you would know what to expect from that game okay so don't forget about the growth part over here don't forget that you also need to start up your heroes you do need to do quite quite a lot of summons and eventually you're going to get some dungeons over here now good good part is that you're also going to get daily up to two different kind of tickets for free but also you can watch ads in order for you to jump again twice in each dungeon which is really important now if you're going to notice that you cannot pass a dungeon what you're going to need to do you're going to come over here and just sweep it okay sweep it in order for you to collect all the resources eventually you're going to unlock the arena and definitely you need to go and have some battles over here now the battles in the arena are going to be quite quite short because as you notice everybody has tons and tons of heroes and here it is the statue will help you over here okay so don't forget to upgrade the statue that i previously mentioned because it will help you also in the arena where you're going to be able to rank in a different kind of system in order for you to collect more and more resources that you're going to be able to get daily so don't forget about that as well the game is pretty pretty simple pretty pretty decent for sure a nice nice game and nice nice graphic interesting heroes that you're going to find over here and it has a lot of chinese hieroglyphics i will give, I will give them that but let's hope that it will do more and more improvements and eventually you will be able to complete all the missions over here to get all the resources that you need also don't forget that you will have the village over here in the village you're going to be able to place different kind of heroes to be able to collect more and more resources out of this game some of them you will be able to build them over here you're going to be able to unlock different kind of chests don't forget about this part over here because also you're going to need this part in order for you to have better and better items that you're going to place on your heroes a lot a lot of repeatable tasks that you can complete in order for you to get more and more summoning tickets for the heroes for the materials and for other things as well don't forget a simple simple nice game go back go into the guild donate into the guild as well eventually you're going to have a guild and also you are going to be able to watch some ads in order for you to get additional additional benefits 
with more attack, more damage towards the boss or more gold coins. So for sure you do need to play this game quite quite a lot. Eventually you are going to get stuck so go offline, enjoy your life and then come back, watch an ad to double the resources, upgrade everything that you can and just try to do your best. Guys, until next time, take care and be safe. Bye.